Salut à tous, c'est Chérelle. On se retrouve donc pour euh, l'épisode 12 euh, de The Consigne, qui, qui n'est autre que Adieu. On avait fait le fer de lance où il fallait trouver la lance de, qui avait percé le corps de Jésus. Et ça avait été dans une vraie misère, une vraie galère, hein, comme, comme toutes les énigmes de ce jeu. Donc on va commencer l'épisode 12. N'oubliez pas de vous abonner à la chaîne YouTube. Un petit commentaire, un petit pouce en l'air. Et vous pouvez me retrouver aussi sur Twitch en live sur des jeux que je ne fais pas sur YouTube. Donc c'est deux moyens de voir des jeux différents. Donc on est parti pour l'épisode 12 et on va voir ce qui nous attend. Le tout va être de trouver les quais, quoi, parce que je ne me rappelle pas du tout où ils sont. Pas du tout. Hein. Un petit tour sur moi-même, hein, histoire de... Cette agression par Napoléon Let's keep calm, please. I, I don't know what you're talking about. I'll have to cut this short quick. Look, I don't know what you're going on about, and I don't have time for this right now. Don't think on getting rid of me so easily, Dirichet. Where have you been? I'm still looking for my mother, if you can believe it. I've been in the manor basement. Faut pas se rater. Hein. No, not a trace. I'm warning you, de Richet. I've got my eye on you. I'll soon figure out what you are up to. And I am convinced that you have indeed robbed Mortimer. The game is up. Give me what you took from me. You know, this is becoming an obsession with you. Show me what you are carrying, or I will call the servants. On va lui donner un objet rare qui nous faut taper. Euh... Une pierre Very well. Fair is fair. You've exposed me. Here. This is what I took from him. Look, I'm sorry. I acted on a bizarre impulse. I don't know why, sir. And frankly, you've disappointed me. That said, it is not as bad as I thought it would be. Right. We'll leave it there. I'm glad that things have been cleared up. So, are we finished here? Indeed we are. I shall leave you. That's right. Go play some more. See you later, monsieur. Ouf, on a réussi la confrontation. Bon, on n'est toujours pas sorti de notre labyrinthe, mais au moins, on a réussi la confrontation. Alors, on a une, un petit élixir ici. Un gelé royal. Hein. Est-ce qu'il n'y aurait pas euh, le, euh, un vilain pas beau là euh, pour nous aider On a la bibliothèque, hein. je pense pas que ce soit là. On va regarder si dans les jardins il n'y a personne quand même parce que bon on sait jamais. Napoléon nous a sauté, Napoléon nous a sauté dessus mais euh, il y a peut-être quelqu'un d'autre. Pas l'air. Hein. Pas l'air, pas l'air, pas l'air. On va rentrer là. Je 
je vais retourner encore à la bibliothèque, hein, ça. Non. Et il n'y a pas... Euh, on est... On est... Il faudrait que j'aille au rez-de-chaussée. Hein. Je ne peux pas aller là. Il n'y a pas d'escalier pour descendre. Hein. Rejoignez votre mère sur les quais. Moi, je veux bien la rejoindre, mais je ne sais pas où c'est des quais, je ne me rappelle plus. Dans la bibliothèque. Bon, ben, on va faire. Euh... Moins que ce soit dans la crypte. Mais non, puisqu'on a eu la, la cinématique à Napoléon, donc on était, on était bon, il fallait sortir de la crypte. c'est que les, euh, les quais sont en bas. Donc, il faut que je descende. Est-ce qu'il n'y aurait pas un des sous-briquets de, de Mortimer ah, une cinématique. Ah, Louis. Perfect timing. As luck would have it. Come, my boy. I would like to have a word with you. Come closer, please. It's time we had a little chat. What's... what's wrong, my lord? Uh, tell me, what's with all the bodyguards? Louis, it's time you found out the truth. I've been observing you since you arrived. I see you running all over the grounds in search of Sarah. I would like to prevent her from leading you even further down the wrong road. Uh, the wrong road? Louis, Sarah has made her own choices of her own free will, and I would like for you to have the same chance. You see, Sarah and I have known each other for a very long time, Louis. I am aware of her theory about me, about Gregory, about the demons. And it's true. She's right. Look at me. I have inhabited this body since 1191. For the last 602 years, ah, I have been this même. dear William Mortimer. Continue. Louis, it's time you open your eyes. Come, you'll soon see. Ce qu'on veut, nous, c'est partir. Il faut vite qu'on parte. I hope I've answered all your questions, Louis. Come, I have something to show you. There, there is one question that remains to be answered. Why me? Why tell me all of this? Oh, haven't you guessed yet? Soyons uh, logiques. I've got an idea, but it might seem stupid. Trust me. Am I one? I mean, am I a demon? Would you like that? I must admit that the idea is appealing. Look, we are of the gods, Louis. Always have been. You, as much as me. You are one of us, Louis. You too are a demon. Are you serious? You know it. Deep down inside, you know I am telling you the truth. Where do you think that natural charismatic presence comes from? Your talent must already have manifested itself somehow. 
Have you ever had any visions? No. Stop it, it's absurd. Have you never found yourself suddenly inside someone else's body without knowing why? No. Whilst asleep, maybe? That's how it often happens the first time. Your spirit wanders unconsciously. My mother can't have lied to me about that. It's true. Your real mother would never have lied I, to you. I... what do you mean? Louis. I would rather you found this out from her own lips, but it's important that you know. Sarah is not your mother. I, what? I'm sorry to find out this enough. way, Louis. But you must know the truth before you commit an irreparable act. No, I... no. It, no, it's not possible. You are my son. Alors bon, Pérou qui s'en mêle. Now you're his bastard. You really took me for a fool. Don't make a move, you clowns. Everybody keep calm. Don't say a word or I'll shoot your kid. Ah, uh, not so clever now, are we? At last I found a way to put the pressure on you, murderer. Just calm down, monsieur. You stopped me from ending it all. Because of you, I've had to pay for it. You don't know what it's like. He's in your head. He's in your soul. I never want to feel that again. Jack, I did not betray you. You're just like him. Monsieur, you don't know the whole story. You oh, man, you One more sweet. move and I'll shoot you down, you bastard. Jack. You'll end up hurting yourself if you continue like this. There's no one to save here anyway. So, what are you gonna do now? You've just found out your true nature. What difference does it make? Rien, je suis toujours le même. Wait, Jack! If it weren't for me, you, you'd be dead by now. You've seen who I am, and this so-called revelation makes no difference. I'm not a slave to my birth and I refuse to pretend to be a victim. I am Louis de Richet. Do you really believe you've got enough strength to resist him? I am who I am. Only our actions truly define us. And you can threaten me all you want. It won't make any difference. Don't change, Louis. You're strong. I wasn't able to make it. You're just like him. You are already. You can't see it, or you don't want to see it. But it's already too late. In fact, I haven't got any choice. You always have a choice. You know very well what will happen to you if you shoot me. Ah, uh, je peux pas le menacer. Between you and me, I'm not as important as you think. If you shoot me, it won't change a thing for the other demons, now will it? It'll be one less, and he wants you. For the first time I can stop what he wants. You should never have come here. You're just like him, and you all deserve to die. No! Louis, you want to learn not to walk into danger. Fear not, I've blocked him. He can't move. One more second and he would have shot you. You wanted to save him during the conference, so, it's up to you to decide his fate. Does he still deserve your mercy? Or have you had enough? I'll let you choose. But there's still good inside him. Free him. Let him think that he just came here for the conference and that he will serve you with devotion. Fine. But are you acting out of compassion or vengeance? Compassion. There, it's done. On lui a fait perdre la mémoire à Pérou, hein? <rire> ah! Oh là 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 là, tout s'accélère là. Not too shaken up. You've experienced many significant events since your arrival. To tell you the truth, I don't get much time to ask myself those questions. Quite right. Best not to react to all this too suddenly. Take some time to think about it all. For now, I think you ought to find Sarah, my son. 
You want to talk things over with her. So she's been lying to me all along? Let her justify herself. What's done is done. Sarah must explain herself. You must clear the air. We'll have all the time we need to talk afterwards. But all in good time. B before you join her, I'd like to give you something. As a demon, I would like to introduce you to your first talent. What do you mean? Open your mind, my son. Relax. You hold immense power. It's already there inside you. Empty your mind of all thoughts. Just let me show you the way. I should relax. Open your mind. Hear my voice. Feel the vibrations and listen to what has been happening to you deep inside, but which you have been concealing. Trust yourself. It's all already in there. I... I can hear something. Now breathe. It's a sound very, very faint. That's right. Concentrate on it. My voice is growing fainter. But ne l'écoute pas, ne l'écoute pas. Whispers, words, mixed voices. Mm. Focus on one of them. Don't be afraid. I, I sense a stream. Some words are clear, but not all of them. Let them enter into your mind. I hear them. Now, now I can hear a clear voice. Well done, Louis. Congratulations. What was it? You are now able to read people's minds. Oh, I... What? You heard me. From now on, whenever a human speaks to you, you will be able to read their current thoughts. So, if you need to know something in particular from someone, all you have to do is make them think about it. Mm. But it, it'd be a violation of their most intimate thoughts, wouldn't it? To begin with, there's nothing obliging you to do it. You already have the ability without even knowing it. I just gave you the option of putting it into practice if you want. Moreover, it would be wrong to evoke morality here. Every species is different, Louis, and this is the way we are made. That's all there is to it. You are free to use this talent or not. And what's more, it will be up to you to decide what to do with the thoughts you read. That is where the values of the right to come into play. There are also a few rules you need to know that govern this talent when used between ourselves. You can read the thoughts of demons as well as of humans. But be careful. A demon more experienced than yourself will know that you are spying and will often react quite violently. It's considered bad form to play around the psyche of another demon. It's a question of courtesy. But let's be clear. What is most considered bad form is getting caught. So I would advise against trying to read the thoughts of Gregory, for example. Home? Yes, the old crump is touchy and rather a stickler about the conventions. On that note, go and see Sarah Louis. Otherwise, she might leave without you. We'll continue this discussion later if you want. Just join me in my study when you've finished. Lecture d'esprit. Vous êtes désormais capable d'entendre des pensées superficielles de vos interlocuteurs. Chaque utilisation de lecture d'esprit coûte un point d'essence. Vous pouvez en récupérer un quand vous rencontrez une immunité. Deux, quand vous exploitez une vulnérabilité. Et trois, quand vous consommez une croix de Malte. Let's see what Mortimer is thinking about. He is thinking he might not have been clear enough with you. When I told you not to try to read into Gregory or her experience to demons, it also applied to me, of course. You, you, you can hear me think? Of course I can. I can sense you. For the moment, your mind shines like a thousand lights because you haven't yet mastered the art of concealment from the psyche. It's not a good idea. So, I give you a weapon, and the first thing you do is try to shoot me with it. If my intentions were evil, you would already be at my mercy. So be very careful on whom you use the talent. All right. On that note, 
I'd better be going up expected. One more thing. If you want to know the truth about your birth, ask her about Paris, 1763, at 12 Rue des Martyrs. That's where she disemboweled your mother to steal you from me. Wow. It's not that I regret all these discussions, but I must hurry to the wharf. Écoutez, on se barre, hein. Est-ce qu'il n'y aurait pas des trucs par là à fouiller avant de partir Des potions ou autre Non, non, je veux pas re-rentrer, mais donc on a pu sortir, on va pas y revenir, hein. Allez, s'il y a rien d'autre. Ah, une potion, tant mieux. Il y avait une petite porte là, je peux pas aller voir. Il y a un labyrinthe aussi. Non, non je peux pas y aller. Et là. Il faut vraiment faire le tour partout, partout, partout. Non plus. Bon, ben on s'en va, hein. Partant de ce maison de fou. Explication avec la mère. What is at stake here far outweighs our personal interests. Our personal interests. You betrayed me. No. Sister? You're the one who pointed her out. You only have yourself to blame. And even after going to bed with her, you were incapable of telling us apart. Oh dear God! Surprise, Sarah! You can't just get rid of me like that. Oh, you that's 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 Tricked your sister. She looked for you everywhere. You're lying. She wasted her time hovering around you. No, you're wrong, Emma. She was ready to kill me if it would have brought you back. She was supposed to lay into you. She was supposed to get even for me. Emily was right. She wouldn't have made me pay for someone else's mistakes. Duchess, I am sorry about what happened. You had a choice. You use people according to your desires without any scruples. Excuse me, but we are in the same line of business. Shut it! And Emily knew it very well. No, Emma, look at me. She would never endanger herself for the sake of the order. Her sense of duty gave way to her personal interest. In the end, Sir Gregory was the only one who was truly honest with me. He has opened my eyes more in two days than my sister did in a whole lifetime. Sir Gregory? He's gotta be joking, right? You're not really gonna trust him, are you? Emily, well, you don't realize. You're just a pawn to Sir Gregory, like the rest of us. He has never lied to me. He took me in, took care of me. Something that no one else has ever done for me. Why did he do it? You didn't see any particular item which he desperately wanted you to give him, for example? No, I... Emma? You are the only one who knows where the Al-Azif is hidden. He's using you. It's that! It's all Mortimer's fault! Mortimer is responsible for his share of all this, but he's not playing alone. Home is serving his own interests too. There's been enough deaths! 
Uh-uh. Mortimer is a demon in the literal sense of the word. He and Sir Gregory have been living amongst us for several centuries now. I know, Louis. What? You knew? Of course. Oh, no. And they can even read our thoughts, would you believe that? But it makes no difference. I serve Gregory. Mortimer can drop dead, he absolutely deserves it. Lower your weapon, Emma. No, I've gone too far to stop here. You are trying to manipulate me again, I can tell. No, why do you say that? That poor Emma is stupid. She would swallow any story you wanted, wouldn't she? No one will ever manipulate me again. She should never have tried to shoot me. No! Don't move! Louis, remember in Paris? I trust you, son. Now, Louis! No, no, damn it! No! Why did you do that? Louis! No, no, no! Come on, mother. Hang in there. You're gonna get through this. Do not trust him. I am proud of you, my son. Ah, zut, on a raté la confrontation du coup. Ben voilà. Alors, j'ai empêché Napoléon Bonaparte de récupérer la linge. J'ai arrivé sur les quais avant que Sarah de Richie ne soit blessée. J'ai découvert ma nature de démon et on a échoué à convaincre Pérou de baisser son arme. Mais j'avais pas assez de potions pour, pour jouer sur le, le côté de sentiment en lui disant Mais que va devenir votre fille Si vous êtes mort, elle aura plus de père. Quoi. Donc je pouvais pas. Je n'ai pas empêché Lady Borough de tuer Sarah de Richie. Et je n'ai pas découvert de mensonge. Je n'ai pas découvert le mensonge. Bon, ben voilà, hein. on, a, on est en deuil, on a perdu notre mère. Bon, ben tant pis. On verra ça dans le prochain épisode. Sur ce, en tout cas, euh, n'oubliez pas, un abonnement à la chaîne YouTube, un petit commentaire, un pouce en l'air. Et on continue bien entendu les autres let's play. Vous pouvez aussi venir me voir sur Twitch en live, sur d'autres jeux que ceux que, que, que je fais sur YouTube, bien sûr. Donc, bah écoutez, je vous fais plein de bisous et on se retrouve très vite pour le prochain épisode de The Consigne. Bye bye